Hello, people of the internet. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, a happy Tuesday to you all. Let's jump into some of the newer music that we have to get into. This is a big one for a fairly different reason. So, for those of you who've been around for long enough, you know my love I have towards the group Infinite, the history I have with that group. And interestingly enough, specifically, Mr. Wuhyun of Infinite was part of one of the very first episodes of OSC Saturday that we have here on the channel. And it was a very good song, and I think it still ranks pretty highly on OST of the year list for me. But he has a solo release out, uh, title tracks titled Baby Baby. That's not the big deal for this era. Um, apparently, he had GIST. He had a GIST cancer in his stomach and had, or in his intestinal tract, and had surgery on it this year. And that news didn't break until like yesterday. That's crazy. So first of all, congratulations on the recovery, Miss Ruhian, because cancer scares are no joke. And the fact that that kind of answers a lot of questions. Like, uh, when Infinite came back with New Emotions, the group comeback earlier on in the year, and they went on Knowing Brothers, Wu Heian had kind of mentioned offhandedly that he was in hospital and wasn't doing well, and that the members showed up even when they were busy to give him his best, give him his best wishes. The fact that that was because he was under the knife trying to remove a GIST tumor from his intestinal tract is so much more severe than any of us probably expected. And, you know, the fact that he went through that early on in the year, continued his idle duties, had an infinite group comeback that was quite a lot of fun indeed as someone who also has quite close attachment to infinite as a group, and was going through that while recovering from that surgery is wild to me. That also might explain why uh, New Emotions was on a little bit of the shorter end. That we didn't quite get the Wu Hyun like vocal magic of past years. So I'm, I'm, I'm seeing Infinite's New Emotions in a brand new light after today. But this isn't about the Infinite comeback. This is about Wu Hyun's brand new solo release. And I am so excited to get into it because I adore his voice. And, you know, he's back. He's back, he's back, he's healthy, and he's doing his stuff. So, let's enjoy it for what it is, shall we? DJ, Rosie and Trump. Right. No stalling from me, no captions, but that's okay. We're just gonna go full send. Here we go! Moves the mouse off the screen too. Hello, Brassy Sense. Little retro tune one time? Not the lip bite. <laughs> okay. Look, I'm a sucker for a retro song. Oh, this is so up my wheelhouse. Oh, oh, this is absolutely glorious. And it's like, sure, the vocal power might not be there yet, but his tone is there, and that's all I care about. Because his, Wu Yun's tone is chef's kiss. It's so nice. Hello, extra bass section or bass part. Oh, 
it does have, like, it's so period accurate. The instrumental mixing is just right, the instrumental choices are just right. Oh, we got a little bit of Wuhan vocal power now. Like, how can you not bop along to this? Oh wow, we're ramping up the brassy synth in the bridge. What? And that transition into the final chorus, so natural. Man, I was enjoying that. Oh, that's kind of cool. <laughs> that's kind of cool, though. It's like finishing with the song talking to Wu Hyun on screen. That's kind of cool. Oh, 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 that song was so nice. I love that. I love that. I am such a sucker for a retro synth song. It's not funny. Like, if anyone does any song that even remotely resembles an 80s, like, synth song, I'm head over heels for it. Having said that, Baby Baby by is just generally a great song, and I thoroughly enjoyed it, because it has everything I love. It's got the... Namu Hyun vocal color and texture that I absolutely adore. It's got the absolutely lovely retro vibe. It's got the retro synth. It's got the brassiness to it. It's got the funkiness to it. The bass part is brilliant. The song is so balanced. The pacing is just right. Ha! But Wu Hyun, for me, there's. This is such a small little detail. But there's, there's a line, or there's a section in the chorus that is just so quintessentially Wu Hyun for me. Like, for some reason, like, here, let me try and find it. Because it's better for the main man himself to do it. Where is it? It's that quick cadence in the chorus is just so Wuhyun to me. I don't know why that specific tiny little section in the chorus is just like calling my name, but that, that tiny little section there is just giving me so much Wuhyun energy. I don't know what it is about it. It's lovely though. Hey, go again. Oh, I have to do this, don't I? It's just some. Don't wink at me, sir. Oh, how dare you! No kidding. But so yeah, something about that line is just so peak Wuhan for me, and I love it. Oh, oh. There's something about this song that I find so much comfort in listening to, it's... Because, like, retro synth songs, if I listen to it, a lot of times, even though I'm not old enough to have, like, grown up during the era when those songs were being released, like, I was born in 97, so I'm not that old. I just like older music and just listening to older music. But there's something about listening to this that is just so comforting. Maybe it's because this song just screams Wu Hyun. Like the vocal top line is just so entirely Wu Hyun coded. And knowing that, knowing the kind of backstory that's gone into what this release is, and what Wu Hyun as a person has gone through leading up to this, 
maybe that's why I'm finding a form of comfort in it. Because genuinely, like, to go through a major operation, major surgery like that, and still coming out the other side of it, sound like really nothing's happened, is crazy. Is that... I can't, I can't imagine that leaves your, like, vocal producing abilities the same pre-surgery. And, like, sure, maybe in certain parts, maybe, like, the vocal power is a little bit on the lower end if we're talking about, like, the average vocal power, so to speak. I mean, not to say that we didn't get any vocal power moments, because there were certainly moments where we got the classic Wu Hyun vocal power in it. But it just, it's Wu Hyun in his element, and he's doing it like nothing's out of place. And I think that's why I'm getting the comfort from it. But that was a lot of fun. Hopefully you enjoyed it as much as I did. But that is it for me today. Thank you all for watching along with me again. Hopefully you enjoyed it as much as I did. One last request for me today. Let's work together as a community to bring a little bit of extra happiness back into the world. Whether it be checking with your friends and family, holding the door open for somebody, or even picking up a piece of trash off the street. Just one small act of kindness to may brighten up someone else's day to day and know that wherever you are in the world, should you ever be going through a tough time in your life, for whatever reason it may be, even though I'm just some guy on the internet who waffles about music in his free time, know that I will always be a friend, an ally, and a shoulder to lean on whenever you need me. So take care of yourselves, take care of each other, spread the love, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.